Assalamualaikum and hello YouTube. My name is Nur Muhammad from NMWash and yes, I am back with another straps review. Okay, so this time around, the subject for today's straps is this very, very cool four types of straps, well, four straps from the Love Watch strap. So I've been uh, in contact with Love Watch strap for the past two years already. He, the owner of this uh, this this website uh, sent me quite lots of tons of, of straps for the past two years and these are a few of them so yeah i think you guys if you guys are uh, familiar to this channel um and you've you've seen quite a lot of them already so but this is the uh, box or the what do you call this a candy candies candy tin that comes with the with every watch per, every strap purchase and yes i think they are one of the you know unique uh, unique products that you can find in the market right now right so before we do that let's do a quick wrist watch check today i am wearing this um adis dive pilot watch um i've done an initial review for this particular piece it is not on an on a love watch strap the straps by the way but it is on this cheapest straps uh, dot com i haven't done a review for this particular strap but i've done an initial review for this watch i haven't done a full review for this particular watch but yeah we'll get to that right so let's get back to the straps so what do we have here so we have uh first we've got this what is it called i think they called he called uh, it's uh, it's called burgundy burgundy woven strap in their website i might be wrong they might call it red so i'm not really sure but it is in red or more to burgundy i think so it's, if it's red it will be a lot more red than this one but yeah it is called burgundy that is why we have this super duper shiny pattern here and we have this what do you call this uh, woven pattern or zigzag pattern <laughs> so anyway very very nice and thick um, strap here so i think this is about 1.3 millimeters super supple and soft uh, to touch and it won't uh, hurt any of uh, the any of any parts of your wrist in my opinion and we have this um circular holes here which for me is a, a much better design comparing to the uh, a rectangular pattern that is easily that can easily free when you wrist when you use it on your wrist right so we have this uh, one fixed keeper here one movable keeper here and of course this adjustable buckle systems right so if you have if you if your wrist is much smaller than mine at mine is 6.75 inch wrist you can just adjust it you can make it longer you can make it shorter so i've adjusted this one for this particular uh, for for my wrist but when you order um the strap from uh, watch uh, lovewatchstrap.com you can put in your uh, wrist size so i normally i usually order something which is longer so i have 6.75 inches i i only i can order it uh in uh, i i normally put a 7 inch wrist so that i have more material on the strap right so right so of course your typical love watch strap the signature we have this skull logo here from the animation one piece very very cool of course like i mentioned just now we can adjust this and when you adjust it of course this one will if you make it if you make it shorter this part will become longer will come to the left to the right side if you make it shorter this one will become shorter that's is is is, is this as is it is as simple as that right so let's take off this watch and put it on my Heimdallah uh, 6105 Captain Willard homage and it is a bit thick <laughs> alright so this 1.3 millimeters is a bit thick when we want to put it on this particular Heimdallah so that is why I always use these quick release pins to get these straps to uh, fit into my watches so it is much easier so we just put it like so and put the quick release, release pin like so boom um yep i think that's in now the quick release pins here right so where is it where is it where's the hole it's a bit difficult to see from the back of the camera guys i'm <laughs> so sorry about that okay yep it's in right so check it out so you can see that on this uh black color dial it the red color the red bug or the, the burgundy color of the uh, strap place really really nice to highlight the um second hands and also the uh, 200 mm, 200 200 meters water resist printing on the on this uh, watch right so just slide it 
out a bit so that I can show you how it fits on my wrist so let's see it's quite simple but of course doing this behind the camera is a bit of a, <laughs> a bit of a hassle guys so yep so you can just slide it in like so no this one cannot so just slide it in like so and boom you can just slide it out so yeah that is the amount of strap that is left for this particular strap so if you guys have a maybe a smaller inch smaller wrist uh, you can still okay but if you guys have like eight inches wrist so you might want to you know spec out a much longer strap when you order this uh, uh strap from lovewatchstrap.com of course love watch strap does give my subscriber and then watch 10 for a 10% discount when you order but currently they are doing a promotion off when you buy three straps you can you can get a 20% discount so do check and check them out right so let's get to the second strap which is um this is another pattern of uh, material that they are using they they call this the black shelby strap i have no idea <laughs> what we what is the inspiration but maybe maybe that the inspiration for this part inspiration for this particular strap is the uh the shelby racing moto company i'm not really sure about that but you know what the difference is on the material that they are using so i can't really describe it um you see that this is much much more smoother right this is a bit rough but not that rough but it's it's a bit different it's your, not your normal uh, woven style but it is not as harsh or when you use it it, you, it won't hurt your skin but the material the fabric use is a bit different and i just really really like this one right so and of course we have this movable keeper here and we have a fixed keeper down here so this is the not as not um like this um what do you call it? single piece this is of course a two piece or a, or a double layer uh, strap um we have the keeper and the fixed keeper here and of course we have the love watch strap the sign logo up top and check out the keepers guys so normally you will have a straight straight and then a bit of a, a bit of a radius and then straight again similar to this one right so yeah that that is this is the normal shape that you will find on your uh, on your standard straps but this one check it out so we have focus come on focus oops okay so we have straight chamfer straight chamfer and also another straight line so that makes it a very very unique oh come on man come on focus sir. very very unique uh, um, design in my opinion so yeah that looks really really cool right so let's put it on the uh, Heimdalla, um, Heimdalla 615 and see how it looks on my wrist all right so check it out guys so that looks cool very very cool in my opinion so the um, the pattern just gives it gives the watch a much a sporty look in my opinion and let's see how it looks on my wrist right so we just put in so you can see that i am on the um, fourth hole so i people with up to eight inches might find this very very nice it can easily fit your wrist so that is how the uh the design of the ham uh, of the ham uh, the hamdala and the love watch strap plays together so and i just think that is really really nice and at the back of course we have this uh, movable keeper here if you don't want to fold your straps for me this is a brilliant design by love watch strap i just love how they come up with this particular design and i'm not really sure why other makers other strap makers doesn't follow this design this is much much cool and much much better in my in my opinion uh, so normally you would have to tuck it in or you have to fold it back so this one you don't need to do that just as simple as that right so let's get to the strap number three which is this very very cool epsom leather strap right so they call it epsom leather strap this color is called uh, oh man please don't laugh at me t-a-u-p-e so is it tope or top <laughs> i have no idea how to spell it but that is the color that that it is is written in the website so it is a bit of a uh, gray plus a bit of uh, brown so so it's called tope or top i have no idea what and anyway so you've got a what is this very very nice um epsom leather uh pattern up top and we have this stitching here and 
very very nice taper from 20 millimeters to 16 millimeters to make your watch looks much much more elegant and on the top right so you can see similar pattern of stitching a similar pattern of the leather and also the the uh, white stitching and we have a fixed keeper here and we have a movable keeper here and on the buckle it mentioned here high noon uh, maybe this is another brand under the brand of um of love watch strap but yeah I, what do i know so at the back we have this um stamp of full grain french leather and the high noon logo is on the bottom oh I forgot to mention that we have this quick release pins right so quick release pins so that you can easily swap your straps um, or with to whichever whichever color do you uh, that you like and also swap it to another watch all right so this is how this uh, Seiko 5 in white dial looks on this tope of the gray grayish brown leather strap so this is how it looks i think it looks absolutely gorgeous and they also have a few other colors as well so i've selected this color and also this blue color so i'm not going to be putting it out to the put it on the straps but on on the watch but i want to highlight a few more items that you can find uh, a few more unique pattern or unique things that you can find on this strap so of course we've got the beautiful blue color here again similar white stitching on top all right so and uh, we have this squid release being similar to that and on this part the buckle right so you can see the design of this buckle is quite nice so they have this what they call this a convex convex um shape there so it looks very very tough so i think they are using a spring bar Yep, they are using spring bars so you can swap it out if you don't like but I don't really see why you need to because I think it is t it is um, okay and perfect for this particular design. Right, so it, it, if it's in blue, so you're just gonna, you're not going to be taking it off, right? So you can see that, well, let's focus a bit more. So you can see that blue works also really, really nice with this uh, white color dial and of course when in it will work with another blue colored dial as well right so there you have it guys so a uh, very very cool new straps from uh, lovewatchstrap.com thank you very much lovewatchstrap.com for, send, for sending me tons of products for me to review all these years and i wish you a very very happy new year over there in singapore man <laughs> thank you very much for supporting me all these days all these all these years and of course for my subscribers don't forget to use nm watch 10 if you want to get products uh, from uh, lovewatchstrap.com or you can get 20 percent off if you buy three straps or more so if you guys like this video please give me a thumbs up if you want to see more future video reviews such as this one please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to push the bell notification twice so that you won't miss any of my future video reviews until next time stay safe bye bye